What's up everybody? I'm here with the Morel Vapor Glove 3 and I am super excited for this shoe. This shoe is ultra light, extremely flexible. You can bend it all over the place, baby. You got that natural flexion of the foot now. What else? It has a Vibram barefoot sole. Yes, you heard me right. Barefoot sole. We are talking barefoot running shoes. So why did I choose the Morel Vapor Glove 3? It has an extremely wide toe box. It has a barefoot sole. No, it is not zero drop. There is about a two millimeter difference in the midsole, but you can hardly tell. It might as well be zero drop. Um, it is extremely breathable. When you're running, your foot gets natural airflow every time you move. And it also has some stretchy, fun strings. It comes in five different colors. I got the fruit punch color. I love it. I was excited. But more importantly, why did I choose the shoe? Those were the specs. What does this do for me? Barefoot shoes. For a while, I'd been wearing normal running shoes, let's say. And over time, I started to develop a knee injury. The outside ligaments on my left knee were in pain every time I would run. This is not normal. Where is this coming from? When we run in normal running shoes, this allows us to hit our heels on the ground because there is such a large cushion. And this impact from hitting the heel goes directly up the leg, through the ankle, to the knee, into the hips. And this impact causes inflammation over time. And this is a recipe for injury. So me personally, loving to run, I wasn't running because my knee hurt. And this was not cool. So I started looking into barefoot running shoes. And I ran into Randy Cryle. Check out his YouTube channel. I'll leave a link in the description below. He expressed the need for barefoot shoes. This is going to force you to reevaluate your form when you run, making sure you are running on the balls of your feet and that your heels gently come down and barely brush the ground before the next stride. This sounds great, but I had to try it for myself. And one day, I went out literally barefoot and ran on pavement. Now my calves were burning by the end of this. And this made me realize that my calves had atrophied by the way I was running before, always relying on that heel cushion, not getting that natural flexion in the foot. And this natural flexion using the tendons and ligaments that are in the foot absorbs all the weight as you go down and there's no slamming on the heel. This turned out to be profound, but I had blisters all over my feet. And this wasn't cool, because I couldn't run for the next couple days. So what did I do? I checked out the Morel Vapor Glove 3, and I took them for my first run two days ago. They were amazing. Uh, I found there was some grass in the bottom which was interesting after the first run, so I slammed them out. You know, they're good to go. I will tell you, one of the negative reviews that I have heard is that they wear quickly, that there will be holes um, on either side from the flexion right here. Now, of course, I haven't experienced this after the first run, but if something does happen to go wrong, I will make another video and inform you because this is important that we buy quality products to support a quality lifestyle. And so far, the Morel Vapor Gloves 3 are just that. I'd recommend you check out Barefoot Shoes for yourself. I'll leave a link in the, in the description below so you can see the Morel Vapor Glove 3 for yourself and decide whether you wanna start running a healthy barefoot lifestyle. Anyway, thanks for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you find value in thinking differently about how we do normal everyday things like running. We can change ourselves and we can change the world. Let's do it together. Anyway, peace.